Hello, dear aquarist, dear lover of goldfish, of fantails, fancy goldfish, orandas, you call it, the people who like the goldfish. This is a special video about a special case. I have seen this problem before and it's hard to define exactly what's causing it. But still, this video tries to explain with my founders, founding, findings what is happening. And that might help you to understand how we can handle this case of a fantail that is losing its eye. So I will share you my findings with my PowerPoint that the fantail that is losing its eye and has very bad internal organs. Case number 229. Fish diseases, treatments, diagnosis and prevention is all available in my books which are available through a link which I published here in my description. Well, a fantail that had eye losses. You could see the eye is gone. There's some the little necrotic parts in there. Well, we try to examine Some of the fantails had eyes that are popping out. We removed it and we couldn't find anything specific behind it. Some reddishness, yes. How is that caused? Well, we check here. The elements we found behind the eye was some necrotic and bleeding tissue. No parasites or nothing specifically that could help us to determine Maybe a laboratory could check this part. Maybe I found some bacteria. But the strange thing, the fish was just losing its eye. And further examination of this fantail <coughs> reveals the very white gills. You can hardly see any gills anymore. It's all white it's tissue. So the gills are really lack of blood. Here we can see there's no blood anymore. So the gills are very bad functioning. That fish was really suffering. Something might be coming from due to internal problems. So we go internal and we see the bad liver, the bad spleen. Of course, the spleen is hardly any spleen anymore. And the liver had very damaged parts. You can see it here and here. But these are things that's really affecting the health of this fantail. And at the same time, there were tubercles in the kidneys. Maybe mycobacterium, maybe a viral infection, something else. But usually we find mycobacteria in some of the goldfish and the fantails. So this fish had very bad internal organs and some lost their eyes. We find out that in the, the aquarium that the larger fantails did love to be cannibalistic and eat a popped eye, popped eyes. I mean, the eyes popping out. It seems to be a deli deli delicious food for some of the fish. And the weakened fish and the sick fish are usually picked on or eating on. And in this case, well, it might be the bigger goldfish that are found love to eat the eyes of his friends in the aquarium. So separate the larger healthy fantails, avoid overcrowding. That might already help the issue of the loss of the eyes. Maybe it's a viral infection. Maybe a secondary or primary bacterial infection, like mycobacterium could be. Well, here a lab can help us to identify. Not with the microscope, we can see, not say exactly if there is a virus or is what kind of bacteria. The treatments with antibiotics could be useful. And a lab can help us to confirm which antibiotic to use. So ask your fish doctor for help. At the same time, you can help the the fish with a functional fish food, particularly the ones which are still eating, and to help to improve their immunity. We would recommend, therefore, a Dr. Basley or Bicer food professional treat in this case. Details on fish diseases, prevention, diagnosis and treatment is in my books, available and in different languages for you, the hobbyist. Subscribe for more cases that will come out in my YouTube channel or get your specific training as for fish doctoring at my Patreon channel. So I hope this case of a goldfish losing an eye help you to understand the issue. Thank you for watching.